Today, Flo's trip. Hi, Lucas. I'm gonna give you a big hug, buddy. I'm so happy to see you. Hi, Hi Horatio. Hi, Plasticines. I'm happy to see you guys, too. And we're happy to see you, too, but if you hug us the way you hug Lucas, you'll crush us. Remember, we're made of Plasticine. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, guys. But Horatio, don't be sad. We're right here, here. Yes! yes! It's not that. It's just that, I don't know. I'm feeling strange. What are you trying to say? You guys know Flo, right? My best friend in the whole entire world? Of course. She always comes to play with you after school around this time. Hey, guys, hang on. Flo should be here. That's true. Where is she, she? Maybe she's here, but she became invisible. She didn't become invisible, Green. You see, Flo and I always do everything together. We even sit next to one another at school. We always play hide and seek, but a week ago she said she was going on a trip with her dad. He's a teacher and he has to go teach at a school that's really, really far away. I feel lonely without Flo. I'm bored and I don't like going to school because she won't be there. Sometimes I see her and I get really happy and run over to hug her, but it was just my imagination. Oh, that happens to me too. Sometimes I think I have a cookie, but then I remember I already ate it and it disappears. Are you sad that Flo's not here, Horatio? Mm -hmm. Very. You shouldn't be sad. What you're feeling is very beautiful. But how can it be beautiful if I feel so sad? What's happening, Horatio, is that you miss Flo. What? Miss Flo? Yes, yes! How could she be Miss Flo? My teacher's miss, and so is the lady at the store, but Flo's a kid, right, Lucas? <laughs> no, Horatio, what Red's trying to say is that the feeling you're talking about is called missing someone. Oh, plasticines, I don't understand. I know, I know, a song. A song. Yawn? I didn't yawn, I'm not even tired. No, Green, a song song. Oh, song, yay, song. Yay! yay. yay. Here in my heart 
get it now, Plasticines. When someone you care about is far away, you miss them. Exactly. Like that time Lucas got lost at the park and I couldn't sleep all night. <laughs> or when you went on vacation with your parents and we missed you very much. Yes, and I missed you guys when I went far away. But you missed me the most, right? Because I'm green and we all know that green's the best color in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Plasticines, it's the mailman. Hi, Mr. Mailman. Did you bring letters for my parents? Hi, Horatio. No, sorry, there's no letters for your parents today. Oh, I see. Okay. But there is a letter for you. What? A letter for me? Really? Did you hear that, Plasticines? I got my first letter. Yay! Yippee! Yay! Yay! Bye, Mr. Mailman. Thank you. No, Lucas, no. I already told you not to chase the mailman. Read it. 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 Yes, it's from Flo. She sent me a postcard. What does it say, say? You guys can read it. I can't read yet, but I'll learn soon. Hi, Horatio. I'm having a really great time with my dad. I'm coming back Monday. I can't wait to see you because you are my best friend, Flo. Oh. You know what, Plasticines? I'll write Flo a letter, too. She can read it when she gets back, and she'll know how much I missed her. See? Missing someone isn't bad. Not at all, Red. I'm going to ask my mom to help me write it. Let's go, Lucas. <laughs> Thank you, Plasticines. You're welcome, Horatio. Bye. Bye. Mom. <laughs> <laughs>